Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, hi, welcome. My name is Anne, and if you're not, welcome back. What we do here is a lot of makeup-related videos. We do makeup unboxings, makeup tutorials, makeup reviews, pretty much anything related to makeup. But today, we are going to be doing the April BoxyCharm. Finally came in. Uh, BoxyCharm is a monthly uh, beauty makeup subscription. Um... It's $25 a month for the base box. They do have the premium box, $35 for it. In the uh, base box, you get five full-size products. In the premium, you get six. And then every three months, um, they do have the Boxy Lux, $50. Um, and you get around, I'm going to say eight products is what they've been sending lately. Um, but everything from them is normally like upper to higher end brands or luxury. Um, I really do like them. It is a good way to build your makeup up quickly with really great makeup. Uh, you can get skincare, hair care, makeup tools, makeup, just pretty much anything like that. So, here's what the base box looks like. I'm going to tour the little sticker. And the base box will always be like this reddish color. Okay. I even looked at no spoilers. I haven't looked at nothing. I uh, still ain't got my phone back. It's driving me crazy. Uh, I keep talking to them. It's been one month. Um, I thought it'd been like three and a half weeks, almost four weeks, but they, it's actually been a month um, or over a month now. And it's driving me crazy. I do not know why they cannot just send me my phone. I'd prefer, you know what, even send me my old phone back. I'll go get it fixed, whatever. But uh, going without a phone is really, really hard. Um, sweet Treats is the theme this month. And we'll set that to the side. Okay, so this is by Kinder beauty or kndr beauty there is their kinder glow palette um i do not think i've used anything by them before like the packaging very cute uh they are cruelty free and vegan recyclable good for 12 months it weighs four times 25 uh 2.5 grams or four times 0 0.09 flow ounces. All right, cute. Ooh, too much light on it. So here is the back. Um, it does have shade names on the back. I don't know if it's on the front. No, ooh, I like this. It does have a good mirror. And boom. We are going to swatch these. I love highlighters. Okay, so this one is Gracious. And I love that. Okay, then this one is Angel. Loving. And Kindly. Okay, so I like the, that one. I'm loving that. It's got like, it's like a bluish gray color in the pan. And it's got the brown spots. I like it too. Let me just add a little bit to my nose. Maybe a little bit more in my cheek. It went a little heavy on the blush today. And it was like a red blush, but It'll be all right. Okay, so I like that. Okay, next thing is Georgette Kingler. I guess I'm pronouncing that right. Okay, so this is their vitamin C mask. Uh, all skin types. It's 1.7 flow ounces. It's 50 milliliters. Well, I think if I didn't drop something, I wouldn't be doing a video right. Okay, so here is the bottle. And 
It's made in the U.S. A, cruelty free, ferropin free, dye free. Oh no, the older I get, um, I like not having that much stuff in my skincare and makeup and stuff because it seems like, I don't know, like stuff irritates me worse now. It's like a brownish, and it is a mask. I don't know what it smells like. It's got a smell, but not that strong. It is kind of thick, but you'd want that for a mask. I don't know what it smells like. A lot of times with vitamin C's, it'll have like a citrus smell. This does not. Okay. I don't know what else is in it. It kind of smells like a flower, but I don't know. It's got water. I don't know. I don't know what that smell is. Okay. Illuminati. And this is their liquid... Lux lip gloss. It has got cute packaging. I do like that. Well, my seal is already broke, but I don't think it means anything. So here is the applicator. It does have like where it holds some in the middle. It's not that big like most of them that holds. We will swatch it. I already wiped the skincare off. That is pretty. I am going to put a little bit over top my lipstick. It's not like ooey gooey. It doesn't feel like my lips are sticking together or anything like that. It's got a little bit of smell, but I can't smell it on my lips. Um, I do like it. I'm very, very particular about lip glosses. I can't stand that ooey gooey feeling or when you feel like you're, you're pulling your lips apart and you just feel like, mm, I don't like it. But this feels really good. Okay, so our next pro... Uh, item is, I was going to say project, but product is the Natasha Denona palette. And it's the 5 eyeshadow palette. What colors did we get? Ooh, browns. Now, I don't wear a lot of browns. Um, if I do, I like to wear a deep dark brown like this out on the outer corner. I do like this one. We will swatch these real fast. Um, I love Natasha Nenona's eyeshadows. I think they are really, really, really good. I've never had a problem with none of them. There's the first one, second one, third one, fourth one, and one more. And the shimmers perform normally really really good the mattes blend really really good i like these uh, i probably won't use it as much as i would another palette um because i like to use a lot of colors pinks purples oranges yellows reds uh greens blues anything like that is right up my alley um this is like a good neutral eye for me this is like how i tone it down is in colors like this because normally i wear like brighter colors but I will try this out. I probably will like it. Because I do like all of her shadows. Okay. So we're already down to our last product. And it is by Studio Makeup. I do not like this lighting. I've got my ring light on and stuff like that. But the camera I'm using, I don't like the lighting with. It needs to like focus in. Um, I gotta get another camera. I still ain't got my other camera. I ain't got my phone. I ain't got another laptop yet. We're just working with it. 
Okay, so this is the Tenant Moisturizer. It's formulated with hydronic acid. It's hydrating, firming, and a youthful effect. Uh, we're getting 1.5 flow ounces, which is 42 milliliters. Now, for a standard uh, foundation, it's 30 milliliters, which is one flow ounce. Uh, so, this is a little bit more than what you would normally get, but it is a tenant moisturizer. Now, I read somewhere this is supposed to be buildable. Um, it's lightweight, buildable texture, hydrating, and natural looking coverage infused with hydronic acid helps hydrate and brighten skin's appearance. And here is the tubing. Focus in. Okay. Now, when I was looking at the shades on it, I did pick this, uh, but I was having trouble picking. And at that time, I'm going to get darker this summer, so I did go up a shade. So, I do not know if it's going to be too much for me, but I couldn't really tell by picking shades. And this may not work for me. I got the shade Honey. And normally, I've got like a lot named Honey that works for me, but this looks a little too dark. Maybe when I tan, maybe not. Maybe as a contour. Like, I'd have to get really, really tan, and I just don't know about that. Like, So I'm, I'm pale, okay? I'm white. Uh, like, really, really pale. Like, I'm just, like, super pale. This is, like, super dark. But maybe. Maybe I'll get tan enough, but I doubt it. I may have to gift this to somebody. Because I don't think I can wear it. Okay. We're going to lay this to the side. I'm very unhappy with that. All right, so we're gonna go over the process. Um, the Natasha Nadona eyeshadow palette is retailed for $48. Now remember, we only paid $25 for this box. So this is covered then some. It's like half, 50, 50, like you paid half price. Okay, the Studio Makeup Tint Moisturizer um, is retailed for $35. The Georgette Klinger uh, vitamin C mask is retailed for $36. Um, so we're already like over $100, a little over $100. The Illuminati um, Liquid Luxe Lip Gloss is retailed for $21. The KNDR Beauty, I don't know why I want to say Kinder Beauty, Kinder Beauty, I don't know, but it is called Kinder Glow. Uh, it is retailed for $15. Here's the packaging. Um, so, you know, it's it's hit over $100. Um, you only pay $25. So, you know, you get to try... Uh, with a beauty subscription like this one, you get to try different things. Things that you maybe you normally wouldn't pick out. Um, and stuff like that. And you get to find new brands, um, maybe colors you don't, I uh, didn't know you, you liked or something like that. So that's why I really like subscription boxes. Um, even like skincare, this, I probably wouldn't have picked this one up and I don't know, I might love it. Who knows? I probably wouldn't have picked this up either because of the shades. Uh, but hey, who knows? I might turn and start wearing browns every day. I doubt it, but, um. If anybody would like to try BoxyCharm for their sales, I will leave the link down in the description box below. But I guess that is it. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye for now.